Okay, here we go. So we're back outside of our tarp set up here on the beach. Um, I'm kind of debating on whether or not I want to uh, attempt to go back inside that cave again. Is that a cannibal or is that my, is that my guy? Okay, that's my guy. Um, I kind of feel like, let's look at our inventory again. We need to probably explore the beach a bit more. Where did all my other stuff? Okay, I about to say Jesus Christ if my flipping loot didn't get, uh, if my loot didn't get stored. I'm going to be, I'm going to have a hissy fit. Um. Okay, so you, apparently you cannot run good on the, on that sand. Let's get our axe out too, by the way. So we're on a, we're on a beach trail. I'm sure these trails are like, you know, more significant than we're giving them credit for. Like I think these trails are probably leading to more, uh, should lead to more actual like campsites and stuff with supplies. Um, and I remember on the forest, there was also a boat out in the distance. But the, the thing with it was, uh, if I think sharks was constantly an issue because i remember getting eaten by a shark and i thought my guts going to drop out of my hind end because it scared the absolute crap out of me okay so here i don't think there's any way to put beacons god dang bro my mustache itches what is this okay we got a person we got an energy bar let's eat that curling up on the beach is never a good idea when you have a tree line behind you because the that the breeze that blows off the ocean will uh, cause you to uh, chill a lot quicker. A little survival fact for you. Okay, but then again, there are cannibals in the forest. But I mean, they can still get you on the beach. Kind of, you kind of present a stark contrast whenever you're just a body laying on the beach. Is my okay? God dang it! Well, anyways, too, I just took him. Uh, I'm trying a new type of coffee for the first time. It's not too shabby. It's called like Three Sisters or something like that. God dang, my nose is killing me. I mean, my mustache is itching me. Okay, I guess we'll just continue with this pattern. I mean, I'm not seeing nothing from a distance. Um, I'm wondering if there's any chance there could be like binoculars or something on here. Because we got those hard storage cases for weapons and things of the like. Is our sticks full? Yes, that's what we need. Okay, well, let's go into our inventory real quick and see if we can uh, craft any more uh, arrows. And there we go. Still haven't figured out where our arrows are being stored at because that's our bow wait we don't need oh we got cereal i didn't even see the cereal printer resin i don't know what that's for that's going to be for another day i reckon yeah i wish we had an arrow count on the screen whenever we pulled our bow out that would uh be a big help Collected. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I was trying to pick that up. Well, anyways, we got a little fire marker there. Get our sticks back. I really did expect there to be more along the shoreline. Okay, we've got a grave site. I don't know what the... Like, there's got to be a shovel somewhere. If I had to guess, it's probably in the cave system. I mean, and we're going to have... <clears throat> oh, I know what I needed to do. I need to make another spear. Um, and this time we're not going to get it stuck in a deer, that's for sure. So wait, uh, the spear was a knife and tape, and another stick. Yeah, I think a spear is like one of the best weapons to use against the, 
the, the uh, cannibals because you can attack them from a distance. And a spear is how you fish. That's right. I just remembered that. Okay, so if there are fish on uh, on this one. Oh, my God. We're, out of, we're running out of steam. Oh, and I'm hungry. Let's, uh, I know I said I was going to take and put one of my oysters. I'm trying to look and see like how much this rejuvenates my food. It's hardly nothing. Okay, let's try this cereal. Cereal's high in sugar. Should give us a lot of energy. Nice. Okay, that actually did give us a good bit of energy. I'm really surprised we're not seeing nothing over here on this end of things. Because we're about to run out of beach, it looks like. Not seeing any ocean life. Don't see anything on the horizon. Okay, up on that hill up there, there's probably something if I had to guess. See, so wait, we got a tarp. Uh, we do not have a tarp. Okay. God, I thought that was a lizard for a minute. Okay, let's whip out the old GPS. That is not what I wanted to do. Okay, yeah, we're walking the shoreline, so we could always beeline up towards one of our already established campsites. I mean, it's better just to kind of zigzag around the map uh, of the area that you're at uh, while you can because then you know you kind of covered a lot of kind of covered a lot of ground it is starting to get night time so oh wait here we go we might have something here it's like a kayak maybe let's uh let's get the spear back out Can't pick up none of this stuff. No fishes in here. Okay, let's go check out the kayak and what's up on the beach. Camouflage suit. Do we have it on? Trying to figure out. Wait, when do we get these lights? Oh, there's our arrows. There's crossbow bolts. We got 12 arrows. Thought we had more than that. We got buckshot, slug, stun gun, 10 rounds, 9 millimeter. Man, these guys didn't come out here with much, now did they? Oh, was an MRE. I probably should have kept this because I wasn't that hungry. Okay, well, let's make camp at the edge of the beach, I reckon. I don't know what this is, because it looks like a healthy person, but they have four arms. I have no clue what just happened, like at all. I think I just give away some of my medicine for no reason. Well, let's camp on the beach, I reckon.
I mean, once we get things figured out, bro, we're going to be rocking and rolling, I can tell you that much. So let's get some Z's. Sleeping on the beach while you got cannibals running around you sounds like a really good, uh, a good way to get into the REM cycle, you know? get our spear back out because then uh, the spear will be really easy it'll make it easier to kill rabbits and squirrels and such okay it'll be really easy to like to run back up on that line right there so let's just take and kind of finish exploring the beaches here because I'm surprised there's no entrances mentioned oh we don't have water that's a problem Okay, yep, we're going to have to go inland. Or wait, you know what? I think we have a drink. But you know, we should probably save these for when we're in the cave. That's that's the smart move. I don't see nothing from a distance, so... We're not going to mess with that. Because I think anything that hurts us like that will end up leading to more dehydration. Let's see if there's any. Where we rested though, our guys got good stamina now. Seems very windy up here. I mean, I'm pretty positive this is a different island. Could be wrong. Okay, this is helping my water a little bit. It's always good to go out here and check like these points and stuff. Then again, if something's buried, you might need a shovel too, so might just be wasting my time here. Wouldn't be a bad place for a base, though, because they can only, like, hit you from one direction. Also a good idea to look for any large trees that stand out. It would be nice, too, if you was able to mark and kind of see, like, what areas of the map you know you'd been to. Okay, don't see no boats. Okay, wait, here we go. Looks like we got a camp. More MREs. So that right there was a little tucked away towards the edge. Possibly have something down there. Just want to try to see if we can find like a fresh water source and then we can kind of focus on uh, going down there. It's just nice being able to have this GPS pulled up because like on the other one, unless you until you found the map, bro, you're just kind of out of luck with navigation. At least I think that's how it worked. Still really confused about that forearm lady. I don't know if that was like her, like a, an actual person that ended up just looking like that because of a glitch or if that was an experiment that was like I, I don't know okay I'm gonna go ahead and just uh, have ourselves a sip of this okay, wait, what is, I know we can make Molotovs but okay, yeah, we can't consume it I thought we could consume it okay yeah, we'll 
we'll head down to this trail. Probably a campsite or something down here at the bottom. Oh, wait, and I think there was some water here, wasn't there? No. There might be a little water outlet coming down through, <clears throat> like a little stream coming out here to the ocean, but... So now we kind of got to commit to uh, walking back around because there's not going to, I don't think there's going to be another way up the steep side of this cliff. Just trying to make sure there's no campsites or nothing up in here. I mean, I would camp on this island. piece of wood. We can't, how much, but I can't stand to, uh, hey, well, we know there's fish. Can't have the spear out while we're swimming, then ain't no gonna be getting the fish. And we got another little cove here that goes back up through that ridge. Yeah, too bad there ain't no horses or nothing like uh, on this island that could speed up our modes of transportation. This might be the uh, the most boring episode because we're just over here wandering the beach left and right. Let's go up. Let's go up this ridge right here because there's another trail. It's probably the wise course of action. It's just there's not as much stuff off to the side as you think there'd be. But I mean, this is not a game that you're supposed to be able to figure out and beat, you know, in a day or two. It's meant to be pretty, uh, pretty lengthy and immersive. Which is what makes it fun. Wait, that one purple thing looks like it might be out in the ocean. Well, let's kind of bushwhack over here and see, like, if we get up on this cliff, if we can, like, see out into where that's pointing at, or if there's just, like, across from, like, maybe a section of ocean, there's another section of land.
Because we've definitely not been... Okay, here we go. We got another... We got some tents. So we found another campsite. That's been ravished. Flares. Four slugs. Eight slugs. Sweet. MRE duct tape. MRE. Vodka. Okay, I think that's pretty much it here. So yeah, this one's in the middle of the ocean, so I think we can find that one. It may, we might have been just flipping tiptoeing right around the other ones that we was looking for, but maybe if we can see the one in the ocean, like the beacon or whatever it is, like if it's on a boat, then we'll know that this isn't just a cave thing. Because I think we can build a raft, can't we? Hey, look at my book. It's good! It's good! Okay, so we gotta take and... Okay, I don't know. Yeah, let's see if we can build a boat. Where's my book? Okay, tree, tree. Furniture, 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 storage, storage, utility, okay, so we've got rock path, uh, birdhouse, scarecrow, standing planner, wall planner, traps, traps, shelter, shelter, okay, we're just going through the same motions, where's X, okay, uh, floor, wall, door, window, struts, stairs, ramp, defensive wall, rope, bridge, firewood, tent. Okay, maybe in this one you cannot build a raft. I don't know. Uh, in the other one you could. So we might have to swim out, and I guess that means we have to run the risk of sharks. Oh, with all that said, before we go down there, let's check this other ridge just to see, because it looks like we can have a better view of what is out amongst the waters. the GPS back out as well so it's right out there but that looks like it's a good ways out it doesn't look like there's any immediate campsites up top right here so uh, let's see if there's a safe way down this large to this larger beach over here because this doesn't look safe at all oh but we don't have a choice Okay, well that didn't hurt as bad as I thought it would. Like it didn't hurt my health bar as bad as I thought it would. I don't know if that's just a camp or if that's people. It looks like out there might be a life raft. Like, way out there. Ok, 
Okay, I think we just got tons of driftwood bobbing. Well, that life raft might be exactly what we're going for. Then again, that's a little off center, I think. Well, let's build a shelter here on this beach because I don't want to have come this far and then die for some reason, like by a shark or something, and uh, have to uh, start over. Okay, I mean, that's what we're going to go for. If I get bit by a shark, bro, I'm going to be pissed because I don't like sharks. I don't like the ocean. I don't like water. I don't like swimming. I don't know why sharks would be in this shallow of water, but sharks are cunts anyway, so what, what, you know, what can you do? Yep, that's a shark. That's nice. Get in. Get in, bro. How do I get in? Thank God, Jesus Christ. Bro, if there's sharks, I'm gonna add my feet, I'm gonna get in here a lot quicker than that. God, you're ugly. I hate you so much. So this must have been it. But what am I supposed to get? Did I get what I was supposed to get? So I must have been right around all the other ones, so that means I'm just dumb and didn't look good enough, I guess. If anything, does anything look out of the ordinary from what we already had? Uh... Oh, we got a gun! Nice. So maybe that's what was in here. That had to be what was in here. I just got it while the sharks was trying to eat my cheeks. Well, I just wasted that flare. Well, guys, I'm probably going to die. But I'm going to swim, swim, swimity swim. It'd 
the most direct route I feel for this. Make, I'm literally like this makes me uh, this makes me have chills and the neck on the back of my hair stand up. I hate being in the water and I hate sharks. Or like the ocean in general. So stupid. Okay, we should be pretty much in the clear here. We just didn't take the most direct route possible. Pistol rail, okay. Oh, uh. Probably wouldn't hurt to go ahead and eat this one. Here we got some tents over here. Okay, so this is a nice little hot spot, and then we'll go back to those purple areas. Actually, I have no clue what this stuff's supposed to be. It's got random stick structures. Oh dang! I know what I needed to do. I needed. I need to save, so I ain't got to go back and do the flipping boat thing again. We'll get up on top of the land right here, and hopefully, ain't none of them stupid flipping meat eaters up here, and we can. Do it, you can do it, you can do it. Okay, inventory. Don't freeze on me. Thank God. I just need to say why I got my thing. Okay, yep, so I guess we just need to kind of go back to uh, that one to our left. Okay, over here's a little pond. Let's see if we can get a sip of water out of it. Might even be some fishies in it. Wait, is that a turtle? Be able to get the turtle shell too, can't we? So there's some things they've definitely changed up with this one. On fire? Oh no, the grass is on fire. Okay. Now this time, let's not run away and leave it. Let's double check make sure ain't no more turtles in here. Because the water is kind of dark. Because, like, while we're here, you know, like, with the fire going, not a bad idea to try to stock up on uh, groceries. Oh, yeah, we do need to get a sip of water, too.
Jesus Christ, what was that? Can I get a sip of water? Oh, there he is. They get so loud all of a sudden. <laughs> the audio sounds like it's like all around you, you know what I mean? I mean, you used to burn them for their bones. I don't know if that's still a thing or not. There's three of them. God dang it. God dang, bro, you have to dip, dive, bob, job, and weave, you know? Oh, oh my guy's out of stamina, that's what's wrong. <sighs> okay, yeah, we're just going to take, we're just going to haul it. We know there's a cave up that way, and we're going to be going by that flipping pulsating circle thing, which I think that means that's like a hot spot area for them, which we've already been to that area. But it's like just across the next section of river up on the ridge is where we found that one other purple spot. So there must be like a, a man down or something, because there must be like a, a beacon from our fellow soldiers slash private military or search and rescue group, whatever we are. Still not 100% positive what we are. Actually, have we been to this hot spot yet? Maybe not. Because we've not been to this part of the island. Because we went to that part of the beach yet. But it's got to mean something. I mean, whatever it is, we're right on top of it. Not get a drink of water out of this? Or can you just not drink when you're not like thirsty as all get out? 
Yeah, I really don't know what some of these things are. I could probably, uh, I'll probably, I'll Google the, uh, the icons. Um, actually, let's do that real quick. Why not? Pause real quick. Pull up the Googles. Um. Here we go. Yep. So we're just looking up icon meanings. Uh, helicopter as cited earlier. This will likely be your main reference point. Caves, purple circles. These represent the U.S. trackers held by now to see squad members. If you're close to a spot and you bring your DB, it will emit a beep. In these places have rewards like flashlights and pistol. Green circles and markers. Uh, these are represent points of interest, usually caves, tunnels, or landmarks. Some might lead to rather uh, peculiar or surprising secrets, such as a room with a 3D printer, which is where you can uh, craft the sled. Um, house. Uh, denotes any tent. Blue K. This is Kevin. Another crash ride becomes a companion, although controls functions are limited. Other GPS markers later, you can acquire the aforementioned GPS tracker. Purple markers, which can lead, uh, can be held uh, companion, so you're also okay. So, though, these uh, these circles that we're passing, there's probably like a cave entrance somewhere or something. Um, I mean, I don't really, I don't really get landmarker. I mean, while we're here, since... And so we don't have to constantly backtrack. I'm not really seeing any spectacular landmark. I mean, now that it's getting dark and I've got this ring light in my face. It looks like aloe. And it is out there. See, I mean, wait, what is this? Is this it? This looks like it might be it. Okay, here's a golf cart. Anything else? Ah, uh, yep, okay, so this is a cave entrance. Well, boys, let's take and uh, nut up or shut up. Let's put a tarp shelter down. Which we do not have. So, let's build a shelter real quick. We'll build a hunting shelter. Probably should get the book out first. Let's go to the other one. Right beside the stream. Got sticks. Is that Kevin? I swear to God, it sounded like that sound came from him. Okay, but fully hydrated. It's getting dark. Let's sleep. I'm not sure if we slept or not. Uh, let's... Where that cave entrance goes? Should be over here. Yep. Okay, we are in the cave, baby. Let's get this lit. That is not what I wanted to do.
need to light this thing here. Nice. Oh. Wait, is there two separate things we gotta walk through? This is a concrete deal right here. We're in a facility. Jesus Christ. We got 3D printed arrow. Huh. Ooh, and we can save and sleep here too. Okay. We can make a flask, a mask, grappling hooks, tech mesh. Oh, wow. Okay, definitely want a flask. Because we do need a way to carry water. Can we make armor? Let me look at my inventory. I don't know if we can only have one or if we can have another. I'm going to print another one just to see. I don't want to go towards that light until... Well, I gotta say, the print time on this is very good. If you ever use a 3D printer, you know what I'm talking about. Okay, so I might have kind of wasted that one. Get my out of printer resin. Oh, I still got printer resin. Okay, we're gonna print a sled. I don't know what this means, like what a sled is. I guess we'll make a mask. That's about all we got uh, anything left for. OK, 
Okay, now let's save again. Sweet. Okay. Let's move out, brothers. Nothing back here. Okay, well, apparently we don't have the key card necessary. I don't know if it's in here or not. guess we will have to uh, come back at a later date. But we know now that this is the one, well we can't really look at it until we get out back outside. But this is the one near the beach where the raft is, which is where we have most of our shelters set up on the beach. Okay, wait, where's my little cabin set up at? There it is. Okay. Let's sleep. Well, if it won't let us sleep, I guess we can move. I'm just gonna run face forward and these guys like we're playing Wick. I just I thought I just jumped off a cliff. Cause I really would like to have the flashlight. I hope I do not walk off a giant cliff. That would be ideal. The torch is nowhere near as good as it was on the forest. So I'm just giving these guys a beacon to come and just eat my cheeks raw, baby. Okay, I've hit a rock. Come on. I'm kind of glad we traveled at night now, though, because it's going to be really easy to, uh... get to where we need to be. I really where I'm going to jump off. I'm going to fall off a cliff.
Come on, buddy. Keep a huffing it. I feel like we kind of got better eyeballs on this now, you know what I mean? But we don't have a tarp. Yeah, I'm just not going to find nothing. Well, I know we gotta be able to build a bigger fire than this. I do want to have my spear out. I thought we had some cooked meat that we didn't eat. 